Hello everyone, in this video we're going to be talking about photo overlays and how you can create your own photo lays using a new feature in the Metaverse Studio. And I'm going to leave this QR code on the screen for the next few seconds so that you can scan the experience and experience it for yourself. Okay, let's go ahead and get started by creating a new experience. So as always, we're going to name our experience. So I'm going to call this photo overlay example one. And let's add a character and some dialogue. I'm going to go into animals and let's see what we can find. Maybe we'll use this rover and he'll say something like the next scene is a camera scene with an overlay. Let's add a button and now let's go ahead and click on the add new button and add a camera scene. And so this is how we're going to be creating our overlays. You're going to see this new button here on the camera scene that says create a frame. Let's go ahead and click into that and you'll be taken to your create a frame menu. And you can add a variety of different characters. So any character that you upload to the Metaverse Studio you can use to create an overlay. You can search for a character using the search bar. So if I search for cat, we'll find a bunch of different cats. Or you can click on more and find all of the different characters from the regular character menu. So I'm going to click on our Happy Holidays tag and we're going to create a holiday overlay for the holiday season. So let's go ahead and add some holiday decorations. And you'll notice that the holiday decorations are now in our photo overlay. So once you click on the image, you can change the image size by dragging the corners or you can rotate using this tool here. So I'm just going to make this a little larger and we'll drag this slightly off the screen. And so now let's go ahead and maybe add a Christmas tree. So we'll add that. We'll turn that just a little bit. Great. And then finally, let's add a hat so that somebody can take a picture wearing one of these hats. Great, so that's all set. Let's say you add an item that you don't really need. So let's say I accidentally added this candy cane. So what I'm going to do is just click on the candy cane and I want to take it off of the photo overlay. So what I'm going to do is click on remove selected here at the top right hand corner. You can also click on start over and that will clear your entire space. So here we have another candy cane. Let's go ahead and click remove selected one more time. And now that is off of our overlay. Great, so now once the overlay is all completed, we're going to click on save here at the bottom right hand corner. This will create the photo overlay and automatically place it into our camera scene here. And you'll notice that there's also a unique link in order to use this photo overlay for other camera scenes if you'd like. Okay, let's go ahead and make sure that these are linked up with our buttons. So we'll transition to scene and this will end the experience. So now we have a completed experience using a photo overlay on top of a camera scene. Again, to reiterate what we just did, we clicked on create a frame here at the top of the camera scene and we created a frame overlay for our image. So again, here's the QR code on the screen so you can scan the experience and experience it for yourself. We hope you learned a lot in this tutorial and we will see you next time.